<sighs> a favorite film that most people haven't seen. Oh, uh... That's a hard one. One of my all-time favorite movies that no one's ever even heard of is Mrs. Brown. It was Judy Dench, and I just, I loved her so much in it. I've been a huge fan ever since. Nuts in May, it's a Mike Lee movie. I highly recommend it. How about Lonely Are the Brave? Or Kirk Douglas, I love that movie. Peter Jackson's Heavenly Creatures, which is actually, was a huge inspiration for me. Oh, my very favorite film is Ivan Passer's film, Intimate Lighting. One of my favorite films is Sherlock Jr. by Buster Keaton, which is an um, old silent movie, uh, incredibly funny and incredibly profound. Rain People, uh, it's a very early Francis Ford Coppola film. It is an astonishing piece of work. My favorite movie that most people have never seen is a movie called Unfinished Piece for Player Piano by uh, Nikita Mikhilikov. There's a film by uh, Takashi Miike, Goju, that, uh, that's one of my favorites. The movie Dolls by Takeshi Kitano is a love story and I really love it. A Matter of Life and Death, it's a, a Paul and Pressburger film. It's a great movie. Love and Anarchy, another one was called The Seduction of Mimi, and another one was called Seven Beauties. And uh, they're just amazing movies. You know, I'm always surprised that everyone in the world hasn't seen at least once, if not 10 times, Barefoot in the Park. A lot of people haven't seen but a lot of people have, a lot of my generation has it. HUD, Marty Ritt, 1962 with Paul Newman. Well, the film I've seen recently that really affected me was an Iranian film called Manuscripts Don't Burn. People of my generation don't know it, either Body and Soul or Angels with Dirty Faces, but they don't know any of those movies. I don't think they know any of those actors. You know, some of the greats that I grew up watching and being inspired by. Maybe a favorite film of mine that a lot of people haven't seen is uh, The King of Comedy, another Martin Scorsese film. One of my favorite films, which has always stuck with me, which um, a lot of people probably haven't seen, is, is Delicatessen. I would say uh, Time Out by uh, Laurent Quinté, who's a uh, French filmmaker. And like all really, really good cinema, it stays with you. My favorite one is uh, The Girl on the Bridge by Patrice Leconte. It's beautiful, it's beautiful to look at. The Bride Wore Black. I love it, I love that film, it's so great.